great Mother's Day. I want to uh, really thank all the mothers uh, for everything that they do. I know the women in my life are the most important people. And with what we have today with Sizzle, it's really going to share some exciting things. We're going to keep it to 30 minutes, and we really want to respect everybody's time. But we're so grateful for everything going on in Sizzle. Once again, this is the Sizzle Sunday Night Webinar. My name is AK, and it's just a pleasure to be here with everybody tonight. We're going to share some incredible, incredible information. We got a, a very, very special guest. He's coming all the way. He had a world adventure venture going in all the different countries that sizzles in. We're in 33 different countries. I think Aaron must have went to 30 of them. This past trip, he was traveling like crazy, sending pictures, sending updates. And we were so excited for everything that's going on in sizzle, what he does for this company. He's truly an amazing and remarkable person for everything that he does for this company. And there's no reason why sizzle over the course of the next five years is going to be the envy of the industry. We are going to be one of the largest companies in the world with everything that we have in place and it just keeps getting better. Some of the other things that we're going to talk about tonight is going to be some of the incredible enhancements that have been taking place in the My Sizzle Pro back office for Sizzle International. We've been releasing updates it seems almost every single week and this week is no different. We have some incredible updates, a really, really cool feature that we're going to talk to you about. But before we get into all that, the one person I do want to bring on because I know there's so many people that are so eager to hear from him, and he's been gone for the past, it seems, month. And he's finally back here with us, and it's just so exciting, and he wanted to be on this call, and he was so excited to share all the things that took place in all the different countries, and I just, the stories are absolutely incredible. So let's try to bring on Aaron Renner here to share some of the amazing things that have taken place over the course of the last 30 days with Sizzle internationally. Aaron, are you with us today? AKIM, can you hear me? Yes, I can hear you loud and clear. Oh, good. Hey, I am so excited to be back on my home soil. I'll tell you that, everybody, right now. It's, uh, it was an incredible trip, but it's always nice to be home, and, and it was just a phenomenal experience. You know, we, we have such a history with the Maurer Mission. It goes back over 25 years, as you know. And to think about it, over the course of this time, where Tom Sr. has gone out into these countries for the last 25 years and literally built them by himself, starting from scratch, talking about things, personal care products, and these incredible products that have science and research behind them. And so when I'm sitting in these meetings, you know, I started off in Kazakhstan, and I thought, you know, I'll make my trip start off there. Uh, I'll go to October. And I really thought, because I'll be, I'll be fresh and ready, I'll take that, that first part of the journey, which was going to be a grinder, and get it out of the way. And really what ended up happening is that uh, it took 36 hours to get there. And, and so I was punished for the rest of my trip because I was just so tired. It was just such a grueling experience to get there, uh, flying from here to New York. And I left on uh, Wednesday morning at 8.30 a.m. Mountain Standard Time, and I got into New York and then jumped on a plane to go to Moscow and got in at, uh, at 9 o'clock the next morning and had to wait uh, 14 hours until I could get on a plane um, that next or that night on the 12th to fly into October. And that, uh, that flight is, it leaves at 11.05, you fly to Almaty and then off to October after that. Only Jim Fulford really knows what I'm talking about here. But, um, but it was just such an incredible experience to walk into a room the first night. I, I got into my hotel, took a little nap, and then went to a leaders meeting. We had 60 people at the leaders meeting. 60 people that are there in this, in this smaller city in, in Kazakhstan, and they are just dressed to the nines and ready to work. And, and learn and, and get motivated and all that good stuff. And so we had an incredible kickoff and went and had a great dinner and, and dancing with all the uh, with all the, the people. It was just a lot of fun. And so the experience really started off perfectly. It was the right note to go off of. And then we jumped on a little plane uh, two days later after we did the big meeting. And, um, and and let me tell you the format too real quick because it was it was a great experience for me as well. One of the things that, that I really did and really structured on this trip was to not only hit the opportunity and talk about people coming into the business and joining this winning team, but then right after I said to them, you know, we're going to go to break and then we're going to come back because people always say, come into the business and, and just start finding people, talking to people, sharing the opportunity, but then they never teach you how to support them afterwards. And so we did a, a training that we called the first 48. And it was really sitting down with people over the course of the first 48 hours they come into the business and showing them, developing their why, developing their story, helping them understand and define why they do what they do every day, 
and why they get out of bed and why they're focused on this. Because if I can help them, and if we can help them, I guess that's a better way to say it. If we, each one of us, can help people understand why they're doing what they're doing, then we can create accountability. This is a difficult uh, business. There's no accountability. I can't call up AK and say, hey, AK, what time did you wake up today? How many calls did you make? Um, how many meetings did you have? How many uh, emails did you send off with my single disk? How many people did you open up and share the opportunity with and the, and the pay plan? Uh, what time did you go to bed? What time did you cut out? Did you put in your full eight hours? I mean, there's a, you can't do that. So the only, only accountability that I can really help you define is I can help you define it by understanding why you're doing what you're doing, whether it's the health benefits, sharing the wealth benefits, pay, you know, changing people's economy. And then if I can help you with that, then I can help you stay on the path because then I can help you with why you're doing what you're doing every day and help you with a little nudge and help you to kind of get up out of the out of your uh, out of your 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 hopes and your dreams and start to define what those are as well. Then we started talking about contacting and getting out and using some of crazy Tennyson's you know words and ideas and it was amazing to just spend that time and talk about some of these things that are so easy and seem so simple, but they're really just door openers. And then we went through goal setting and we talked about commitments and we talked about dreams again and we talked about being a leader and starting to develop your business and being a product of the product. And all of these things take, uh, especially, it's, i got to tell you guys as well, it's so nice to just speak English the whole time because with the translator you get, you know, your put sentences and then you wait for them to, to talk and say something and you're not really sure when they're done and then you got to kick it off again. And luckily I've had a lot of good experiences over the last couple of years to, to help with that, but, um, but it's fun to just to just roll with it. But we had these incredible training set up and you can't believe how many people got involved in the business. I think in October we had about 200 to 300 people in the room the first that was our first meeting. Had so many people literally raise their hand and say that they wanted to join and be a, a member of uh, Sizzle and be a part of it immediately and they, and they signed up right there on the spot. And, and so we welcomed them into the group and then sat down and then trained them on how to do the business. And we did that from that meeting all the way through till the end in Berlin. Uh, which was this last um, Monday night. So when we when I flew over to Axel, we had a great had a bunch of great meetings there. Um, really incredible meetings with the leaders as well. Then went off to uh, Belize, Georgia. It was funny the night that um, that I left. It was it was really just happened to be my birthday, and so but my flight left at 1:40 a.m. and I so I went to the airport at about 12 12:30. Got to the airport, checked in. Um, Got on the airplane, flew to a little uh, a, a little city in Azerbaijan called Baku, and they wouldn't let me out of the airport terminal because I didn't have a visa for the country. So then I spent 12 hours on metal benches, literally staring at people for 12 hours, and they wouldn't give me give me my passport. They confiscate it when you get off the plane, and you just sit there. So I sat there on those stupid metal benches for 11, 12 hours until they finally gave it back, and then I could jump on a plane. But it was well worth it. I got over to Georgia. Same thing. Incredible meetings. Incredible leaders. Um, great, great uh, um, structure in those countries. We do what's called the Socus model. And uh, what I want to do on the call tonight as well is give you some of these ideas on how we do business, so that you guys can start looking at opening up your your opportunity floodgates into some of these other countries. But we have what are called Socus models. So it, it allows people in countries that don't traditionally have credit to go down to a, a warehouse and they can buy product right there. And so we've got all these people that come in and they'll do it's a cash business. They'll walk in and buy all their product and they walk out with their bags and all that good stuff. Sometimes we forget that the amenities that we have in America and uh, in Canada are so easy. It's so easy for us to do business. We've got all these incredible tools that we're going to talk about tonight. Over there, folks, they don't have anything. So these guys are using you know, just word of mouth and belly to belly, which is the way the business was built originally. And I think sometimes we, we want the, the, easy, the easy way in life. And so like AK said at the first of the call, we continue to add updates. We continue to give you more and more tools. And I can't tell you after spending a month over in, in, uh, on the continent of Europe, I can't tell you how incredible it was to watch these people that day in and day out just go out and make it happen. And uh, so then I, I went from Belize, Georgia, I went over to St. Petersburg in, in Russia, had an incredible meeting. I landed at about 3.30 in the afternoon. Uh, showered very quickly in the hotel and then uh, I think I was ready at 445 and the meeting started at 5 o'clock and so I ran, walked right in and he kicked off the meeting, went for four hours because of translation and then at 9 o'clock they said, okay, hey, we've got to hurry up, we've got to get to the airport, we've got to fly to Moscow tonight at 11. I said, oh my gosh, are you kidding me? 
So I jumped on. The, I jumped in a taxi. We went to the airport. I jumped on a plane at 11 o'clock. Landed at 12:30. Got to my hotel at 1:30. Next morning, they picked me up at the airport, at the hotel. Ran over, did an incredible meeting in Moscow uh, in this big auditorium, this big, huge field auditorium, and it was a phenomenal meeting. Had a great training session and talking about the business and talking about um, the working relationships. And the next morning, I woke up, did a video conference with a group down in Nova Sibiris. Had this big room full of people that were that were listening and and taking notes, and they had a bunch of recognition that we did for these people that were becoming masters and one stars, two stars, three stars, four stars, five stars the incredible recognition that these guys are getting for building their team in these areas that are so remote. And then we, then I flew off and I went to Kiev, Ukraine, and uh, Kiev was incredible. We've got a, a, a phenomenal person. And in all of these places, everybody, these people have been with Tom for 18, 19, 12, 14, 15 years where they just have had these experiences, these deep-rooted sessions where they've understood exactly why the, the mission is so important and so valuable. But here's what I can tell you is that when I was in Kiev, I, I got a bit of a sinus infection from flying, you know. By this time, I'd been on quite a few airplanes. And uh, they said, no, you really should go to a doctor. And so I said, oh, you got to be kidding me. I don't know if I really want to go to a doctor here in, in Ukraine. I mean, it's, a, it's just a little bit different uh, different culture and community. So uh, they finally talked me into it as I came back from a, a meeting in one of the small cities outside of Kiev. And, so we went to the hospital and we walked in. It was about 8:30, you know, 8 o'clock, 8:30 at night. And this doctor met me, and so he, I, I'll, I'll skip all my, uh, my ability to make the make my voice sound like his. But he said, in in general, you know, let me check you out. I'm a doctor. So he put on one of those old school little headbands with the with the metal uh, reflector thing on the top, and and uh, had on his little white lab coat. And he looked in my nose, and he looked in my throat, and he looked in my ears, and he said, okay. How have you been feeling? Have you been feeling feverish? I said, well, not too bad. And he said, uh, but you feel like you're, you're, you've are you got some sinus issues. I said, yeah, I do. And he said, okay, well, he said, I'm a doctor. And as a doctor, I need to give you my opinion. You've either got a viral infection or you've got a bacterial infection. You're either going to get worse or you're going to get better. And I said, are you kidding me? That's, that's your diagnosis of me? And uh, I looked at my translator, the guy that I travel with when I'm over in Ukraine, and there he was, this guy, uh, uh, Sergey. He was, he was. Uh, I was just laughing my head off. I said, I said, this is real. This is serious. This is the doctor. And he said, Yeah, welcome to Ukraine. So we left, and he, that was literally his his diagnosis, and that that was what I left with. So I can see why these people rely so heavily on these products. And as I walked out. I realized that it was our opportunity to go out and help people understand, just like we're teaching and educating people here, to help them understand how we can live a better life and how we can have these products that are natural and, and God-given and help us to just walk in the door and start educating people on, on making an alternative source or alternative a decision on what we need to do. So then I went around Ukraine. I flew into uh, a little, a little uh, city called Kharkov and had a great meeting there. As a matter of fact, we had 15 people sign up at this little city. Uh, and then they said, OK, Aaron, you got to get to a train tonight um, at 11 o'clock. Got on a train for 12 hours. Now, mind you, these are not nice trains. Um, but I did have my own sleeper compartment. If you guys follow me on Facebook, you probably saw some of the pictures. But I, I, usually, I posted pictures when I was somewhat amazed or appalled. And this one, I was uh, appalled. I was, so, I was in this little sleeper car or compartment for 12 hours got into Sevastopol, which is a seaside town. They've got a Russian uh, naval fleet there, even though it's in the Ukraine. And then they've got um, they've got a Ukraine, I think, four ships for Ukraine. And um, walked right in, no shower, no anything, walked right in and did the meeting because we'd shown up. The train took a little bit longer. Had an incredible meeting there, and it was interesting. One of the guys got up and he talked, and he said, I said, would you share your story with us, please? And his name was Vladislav. I said, would you share your story with us, please? And he said, he said I will. And he said, and he, he told the story about how one day he was walking down the down the sidewalk, and at the time he was he was working he was working for the military. He was a military person, and he said, "I was walking down the sidewalk, and my son looked up at me. We we passed an ice cream shop, and he said, Daddy, would you give me an ice cream cone? Could you buy me an ice cream cone?'" And he said, he reached into his pocket, and he had no money. Couldn't even buy his son an ice cream cone. He said, "It was the worst day of my life." I couldn't believe that I didn't have enough money to even buy my son an ice cream cone. And here I was working for the military, working for the government, and I couldn't even provide that for my family. 
And he said, so he knew something had to change. He had to make a change in his life. He had to make a difference. And he said he literally, at, the, at about that point, somebody came to him and was talking about these incredible products that they'd come across in, in a business opportunity in, in Trump's past company, New Way. And he said he was absolutely amazed. He said he walked into this meeting. He said he had no money, but as he talked to these guys about the business, he realized that he could make a change. He could make a difference for his family. So he went and borrowed money from his, from his family. And, uh, and he went and got involved in the business. And he said since then, he's been able to move to two bigger apartments. He's, he's been able to buy two new cars. And he's been able to send his, his kids off to, to higher education. And he said and he's been absolutely blessed by this opportunity. And he said, so any of you in this room right now, they think you want to make an excuse as to why you can't do this. There is no excuse. And if you want to make a change in your life and change the way you do your business and, and not be sitting on that flat, that flat, existence for the next 40 years, 50 years, 60 years, then change, make a change with us. And I mean, it was dead silent. Everybody was just sitting there, some wiping tears. And that was, those were the kind of meetings that we had. And so I got into another city that I really can't remember even what the name of it is. I apologize, and I'm glad they're not listening. And then we went to Donetsk and uh, had, had, again, incredible meetings in both, jumped on a plane, flew to Austria or to uh, Liga, Riga, Latvia, had incredible meetings there. They had just a packed room, a couple hundred people just packed in this room. We had a phenomenal opportunity to, to go through these trainings, and everybody was so excited. We then did a river tour on a boat because Riga sits on the river, and it has old Riga. It is absolutely gorgeous. At some point here in the near future, I'll start dropping some of my pictures that I, that I took while I was there. And then I uh, jumped on a plane, flew over to Austria, drove immediately with Udo Depesch, immediately drove down to uh, Ostrava, Czech Republic, had an incredible meeting there, went back in the car that same night, drove all the way back uh, um, to uh, Austria, slept that night, jumped on a plane the next day, went to Romania, uh, went to Bucharest, had an incredible meeting there, I mean, a phenomenal packed house, everybody just just enamored with this, with the company and the mission, the products, the, the training, and then uh, jumped on a plane, flew to Berlin, had my last meeting there. And, uh, and that night, um, we did it in an old, uh, it's called the Hollywood Hotel in Berlin. And it was this really great screening room. And we, we showed the, uh, we did a, a German voiceover uh, of our opportunity video that we just sent out that everybody knows about. We did it in this big screening room, so it was like a, a cinema. And it was absolutely amazing, great tone, great way to end the, the trip. And I just want you guys to know, as I, as I got on the plane and I put that on my Facebook, that I, by the time I got home, over the course of 30 days, I'd been on 20 different airplanes. I'd been on uh, four different trains. I'd been in how many cars, I don't know. And the, and the time that I spent there was so valuable. The people and their, and their commitment, their desire, their passion is no different than yours that are on this call. It doesn't matter where you go in the world. This Mauer mission is, is the same everywhere. And to sit and talk to people and have these opportunities to have them share with us how they started with nothing. I had a, one of the women um, down in Hardcock said, you know, I didn't even know how I was going to do what I wanted to do in life, but I knew I could do better. She was a nurse. And she said, I realized that I had no money to do anything more than just live. That was it. I could just barely live, make my payments for my living, eat, and that was it. And she said, but I knew I wanted more. And she said, so... Somebody came to her and talked to her about New Way. She ended up getting involved for $1,000, $1,000 U.S. dollars. This was uh, 12 years ago. And she walked in the door uh, to her uncle. She said, listen, can I borrow $1,000 from you? He said, you know, I really can't. She said, please help me. I've got to make a change in my life. He, he ended up lending her the $1,000. And in three days, she had gone out and sold all of the product and then some and was able to pay her uncle back. He said, hold on a minute, left and, and went to another room walked back in the door and, and sat down with her and he said, I thought you were testing me. So I wrote down the serial numbers of every single bill that I gave you and I thought that when you brought that back in three days that it was, it, you were just going to give me back the same $1,000 that I'd already given you just to test me. And he said, how did you make $1,000 in three days? And she said, I have to tell everybody, everybody about these problems. I can't, now that I know what I know, I can't not tell them. So I want each of you to know but sometimes we think, wow, it's, it's difficult, wow, it's hard, wow, we've got, you know, broken pieces in, in, in our tools or in our MySolo Pro or in our MySolo Disk or some of these different things that we're going to go over tonight. Sometimes we think, geez, we just can't, 
you know, the conference call is not working. You know, maybe I'm breaking up a little bit on this call. But the fact is, you have no idea what you have until you go over to some of these countries and some of these cities and you spend time with some of these people. And I, I, I have a, a traditional rule where I'm, when I'm in foreign countries, I won't go to people's homes for dinner. And I took uh, some people up on it when I was down in Accra because they said they really wanted to feed me a birthday dinner since I would be traveling the next day on my birthday. And so I went to their house. And it looked like a bombed out apartment building. It was, it was amazing. I walked inside with them and went into this little apartment. It was traditional Kazakh eating style. So we sit on the floor on this little teeny table that you can barely fit your legs under, especially mine. And I, I'm uncomfortable. It's hot, sweaty. I've got my, my suit on. And I'm sitting on the floor with these people who are so giving that it probably didn't have enough money to even pay for their food for their family. They've got eight kids. And they sat down and fed me at this incredible meal. Uh, I will admit that it was, um, I took the first drink of milk, which I'm not a huge milk drinker, and I swallowed it, and I about threw my neck out um, because it was uh, the weirdest taste I've ever tasted, and it was a little bit interesting and sour. And I said, oh, interesting milk. Uh, what, what type of milk is this? And they said, oh, it's camel, camel milk. And I said, oh, my, very good. Thank you very much, you know. And then they brought out the meat dish, and I was chewing on this, this meat, and I just was chewing, chewing, chewing. And finally, I, I was having to use the camel milk to wash down this meat. And I said to them, um, oh, it's great meat. What is this meat? And they said, oh, it's camel meat. And I said, fantastic. It's perfect for me. So I just want you guys to know that it was an incredible experience. It was, it was one that I've done before. Every time I come back, I have this renewed passion and, and commitment and energy to go out and help everybody, to see people's lives change. And it's amazing what I start seeing. And I'm, I've obviously spent a lot of time watching people on Facebook, and I'm seeing results, and I'm seeing people lose weight, and I'm seeing them take back their lives, and I'm seeing them make money, and I'm seeing all these changes take place that is just, it's, it's so wonderful for me to be standing here on this call tonight and to share this story and these experiences with you, and so I want you to know that I can't wait to get on, and I want to do this training online so that we can do a webinar and take you guys through the entire webinar and have you have the, the workbooks that we've created. I can't wait to do it. I can't wait to come out to your cities and follow up Tom's tour of these mini conventions that we're doing and, and then me come in and, and uh, some of our other leaders and train you and show you how to do the business and show you how to start making money and to do it correctly so that you can start winning at this race. So anybody, anyways, everybody, I'm so excited to be back. I'm so excited to be a part of this call with you tonight to share these experiences, to talk about these updates, to hear from AK and Jim and, and all these incredible things. So AK, I'm going to send it back to you. Hey, Aaron, thanks so much, man. I, I mean, we really, really appreciate you getting on, and I know you're traveling right now, and you just got back from this incredible, incredible trip, and the stories that you have, I mean, you have probably a thousand other stories, and we'd probably be on for hours if you were going to share them all, but we appreciate everything that you do because you really are one of the heartbeats of this company with everything that you do to help us grow and do everything that we're doing um, on our end here in North America, and you're right, we are truly blessed with everything that we have here and sometimes we take that for granted and with a lot of what's been going on with our uh, our system that we have in place to really help people build their business like it's never been seen before one of the things that we've introduced uh, was an updated academy where all the information all the tools all the calls all the webinars everything that takes place is all archived and housed inside of the sizzle encyclopedia where everything is in there and the beauty of of this whole thing is you can share every call every webinar for instance this webinar will be inside the Academy right when this is done so you can share it push a button send it in an email push a button share it on Facebook and have people be able to listen to this in case they miss this that is so powerful with all the stories and everything that's on here but what I want to do I want to talk about some of the updates that we have and we're going to go over today we have a ton of new content that has uh, been updated inside here, hundreds and maybe even thousands of calls and information now. And one of the things that's really incredible is the Ask Tom section. Tom has been going in there and just answering questions and posting updates, and it's, it's really remarkable to have an owner of a company and Josh and, and everybody else that's been uh, putting in information there, as well as all the users. It's really building an incredible encyclopedia. Now, one of the things that we're going to also share with you are we now have community features as of yesterday inside of the Academy. So you can go in and you can post and comment on certain calls that you like. 
You can talk about uh, the different articles that took place. You can actually like certain fee uh, calls and webinars, and it'll actually like it on your Facebook. And one of the things we're going to show we're really excited about is a new updated academy um, that has a community built in where you can go in and say, hey, I love this call. Hey, I'm doing a meeting. Hey, this is a great experience that I just had with these products. And be able to share it just like you would on Facebook within Sizzle in an upgraded version. And the big thing that we're going to talk about tonight, and that'll be the last thing that we go over, is the new Sizzle calendar. This is going to knock everyone's socks off. And it ties into the weight loss challenge we're also going to go into. But what I want to do, I want to bring on a good friend of mine, somebody that I've been working with now that's going to go over a lot of these updates. And we're going to share the different things and what they're capable of doing is Jim Fulford. Jim has been on here for about four or five months now, and he's been working really closely with us. He's part of the team. He's so excited, and he's so talented at helping to build everything that we're doing. And he's truly a valued asset that we love and care about, and we're just so grateful to have him. So, Jim, are you with us? And let's talk about some of the stuff that's going on here. I am, AK. And first of all, I wanted to thank, thank Aaron for sharing his great story. And I think your new slogan is now going to be, I walk a mile for a camel. <laughs> and, and, uh, and also, I really want to go out there and welcome and welcome, um, and really wish a happy Mother's Day to all the sizzle moms. Uh, you know, because everyone's got a mother, and it's a great time to celebrate. And uh, and uh, as you heard, Aaron Renner was um, talking about. I I spent some time my, me and my wife over in Kazakhstan as well. In fact, uh, you know, we adopted our son from there back in 2001, and our very first Mother's Day was actually spent in Moscow. Uh, so, but Mother's Day, of course, will always be a special one for us. But AK, we've got a lot of new things to go over tonight. And as you talked about, tons of new content. And really, you know, we would like to take credit for it, but really. It's because of the team. If you take a look at the content and click on the series, okay, you're going to see a whole bunch of new sections. And these are really where leaders have reached out to us and started posting their conference calls, their team calls, their webinars, their information, their bios, their testimonials, those types of things. And so this is a section that has just grown tremendously over the last couple of weeks, and we can imagine what's going to happen over the next six months. But really, this is a great place in, in where you know, no matter whose team, what part you're on, you're going to be able to get tremendous amount of content. And again, if you're a leader in the business, got a large team, we want to also encourage you to get your team's uh, content, your your calendars, your testimony, all those things out there. Because really, this is a get to push out for everyone and lets everyone benefit from the amazing content. And so that's been a great thing because you know, helping monitor your system. I see these posts coming in every every day, and there's so much that you can learn from all these great content and things and especially the Ask Tom section. I really wanted to you know, send out a congratulations to Tom Maurer. I know that um, you know, Beverly and some of the folks there have been pushing him along uh, to make sure, but we have had a tremendous response to people a asking questions uh, and posting some phenomenal questions about products and things. And it's fun because what happens is, is, is Tom Maurer or the staff gets online and answers them. These, of course, get emailed back to the person that asked them. But I want to encourage everyone on the call to Make sure that you monitor this section of the site, and and there's really important that you do that uh, because what I found out is every day I'm getting these posts back on the questions, and I'm constantly turning my wife Peggy, and I'm saying, hey, you know, here's a fascinating thing about a product, and you know, because I just heard this a bit on the question because someone asked a question, and it's of course, AK, it's really easy for them to do. What anyone can do is they can click on any of the questions in the Ask Tom section, and there's a couple of links on the bottom of the page where they can come in and they can, if they just want to get the questions from Tom Meyer, of course, they can click on the link on the left side. But if they want to click on ever on all the FAQs, if they click on that, you'll, you'll get notifications. And the great thing about these is you don't get notification when the question gets asked because it goes into a special queue. But as soon as Tom gets online and answers the question, it's going to send the note, of course, back to the person to ask it. But if you subscribe, it's going to send you notification as well. And this is a great feature. And ACAT wanted to really just congratulate all the people, Josh, uh, you know, really Fabian, all the folks at the home office that really made this section great and wanted to encourage all of you guys to really subscribe to this section because this is really one of the best training and learning things about their product because this is giving you up-to-date, immediate information on all kinds of conditions and medical things and health things that can impact you. So this has been a great section, AK. Yeah, you know, Jim, I totally agree with you because as the company grows, people are going to go in, and that's why we encourage every single person, if you have any type of question, post it inside of the Ask Tom section because somebody that knows the answer will respond. And what that does is, it's like you said, Jim, people are able to subscribe to certain posts, 
in certain content, so they will automatically be notified on top of that for the new people coming in. They can simply search a certain topic and it's all archived within this incredible academy. So the information will be there forever and you can imagine over the next six months, 12 months, 24 months, we will have the greatest foundation of information that any company has and it will be all in one place simple to find. So I'm really excited about that as well, Jim. Yeah, that's that's great. And uh, another update I want to talk about, AK, is the community. I mean, that was, this was something that you, after we did the academy a couple of weeks ago, we introduced it. AK, you came and said, "Hey, this is awesome. We need to figure out how to really add more and more community features because, of course, this is not meant to replace your Facebook. It's meant to give you more community." And and so we did a tremendous amount of enhancements that we're going to show you, and you'll find it as you're going to the site. But one of the big ones is you just you can comment pretty much everywhere on the site on you, you, every pretty much. Uh, all the new nodes now, as they're added, you're going to have a link to add a comment. And this is really where you can add comments. And I want to tell you why you want to do this. Not only is it fun to comment and not only will the system notify you, but for example, you know, I was on the Thursday uh, Wake Up With Sizzle call listening in, and there was a phenomenal testimonial. It was about Bill DeFeco. And I'm thinking, I need to take that testimonial. I need to record it. I need to send it out to everybody I know because it was just it, it was inspiring. It was amazing. And I love that. And so, of course, I went online and made a comment. Hey, this is a great testimonial. Everybody needs to listen. And I even kind of put, hey, you can look it's in 33 minutes into the audio. But the benefit of that is that since I've now commented on it, that's going to give more information about the audio. So it helps all the users out there really describe and comment and make the audio available. And then when someone comes in in the future on our academy and they're looking for information on Bill DeFeco, they when they search his name, it's going to come right to the particular wake up 11 o'clock call and he was featured on with a story and so that's a great thing it's going to add a lot of features to the community is being able to do that now if you look right above that you notice that the, the comment in the only section that's been added to this, this page AK there's also a button that says like it and so the like in, in, in any all the posts out there every pretty much thing on the on the site now has a like button and what happens is when you hit the like button two things are going to happen the first thing is going to pop a little thing and say hey you can add a comment and then uh, you can type a little uh, description about, hey, why you like something. And then it's going to actually put your little icon from Facebook. It's going to put your name. And that's going to be on the site so that as you're cruising the academy, all the posts that you like, you're going to continue to see. Now, what's nice about it is, again, as you know, on Facebook, things just scroll off and you miss them. But here, things are going to be continually bubbling to the top of our academy because, you know, everything is searchable index. And so it's going to make it very easy for you to like and find things. But the biggest benefit of when you hit like something and you comment on it is it automatically what the system does is it puts it right into your Facebook profile. It's going to give you uh, whatever the comment you type is going to go on the page, and it's going to actually have a link right back to the Sizzle Pro Academy to the actual article that you liked. And anyone, all your thousands of friends on Facebook can see why you liked it, and they can click and watch the video, listen to the call, or read it. So it's a great feature, and it takes one little click to do that, AK. And so the like it function is something I really like. Yeah, Jim. You know, this, I know we were playing with this um, over the course of the last few weeks and really getting this thing dialed in. And how it works is really incredible because, I mean, let's face it, how many people have Facebook? It seems like every single person in North America that's part of Sizzle probably has Facebook. And now if you like a certain call, you can actually push one button that says like, and it posts it on your Facebook wall. And then from there, it's like you said, thousands of people can see it. You could click share. You can comment on it. You could direct people to it. And the moment they click that link, they will be exposed to what you liked about it. They'll be able to listen to the call. Even if they're not part of Sizzle, they will be able to listen to the call simply by you pushing like it on Facebook. And, and this is really incredible. It's going to help everybody. That's why we encourage people to put their information in the academy because sharing it is going to be so powerful. Uh, absolutely. And one thing you're going to notice is that, you know, we've got, you know, probably seven, eight, nine, ten Facebook groups. You know, we've got Sizzle the Main Event, we've got the club, we've got the Wake Up with Sizzle, tons of, tons of Facebook groups. And, of course, if you're members of all of them, you might watch the post. But so we've actually also integrated a really, um, it's kind of like a combination between Facebook and Twitter, a new community feature right into the academy. And so anytime you click on the community, it's the right link right up top, it's going to bring you to the community, and it's going to ask you to share what's on your mind. It's going to give you a nice little scrolling thing. Again, you can link, comment, you can share links, you can share websites, you can share photos, all those nice things. But what's going to happen is you can just put your comments in there, and you can, and that way you can drop off notes, and you can have a chat going with people that are part of the uh, 
of the Academy, and there's many places this is going to be on the site. Of course, it's got its own community page, but right on the home page, as soon as you hit the Academy button, there's going to be a new block on the right, and you can just go in and type in your information. You, know, you can type in a little journal note right up top, hit the share button, and it's going to share your information, and you'll see a scrolling list. It's going to be kind of a nice little comment section. Again, just more ways to, to, for us to share with each other, let us know what's on our mind, and of course, also attach part right to your profile is the thing is you can see all of your particular updates that you've made. And so this is a nice little feature to be able to go on, uh, comment on things, drop notes things, and this is a really nice feature to add more community, but it's nothing like what the coolest feature is we're going to show them next, AK. Okay? Absolutely, Jim. This is definitely going to help the culture, but you know, I know we're running a little uh, over on time, so let's dive right into some of the really incredible stuff we're going to share with you right. tonight. Absolutely. This is my favorite new feature. I think will maybe everybody, and it's really the new Sizzle event calendar, and you can think, well, what's so great about a calendar? Because we got one on the Sizzle site, and we got one on my Sizzle Pro site. Well, you guys haven't seen nothing like this. What this one was going to do is, of course, you could just go right from the event on my Sizzle Pro, and it's going to give you a calendar, much like what you see today. It's going to be color-coded. It's got all the event, those things on it. But just it's going to be not a, just a static page with a bunch of links on it. It's a very interactive live calendar. And one of the first things you're going to notice as you look at the calendar is that you can search and filter the calendar. So, for example, if you come to this box up top and say, I want to see just corporate calls, and then it's going to show you just the things on the corporate calls. Or if you want to just see home meetings or just want to see uh, weight loss parties or conferences, as you do these different uh, event types, it's just going to show you those. And even more powerful is there's a keyword section here. If you know that there's a meeting coming up at, at Rick's house and you type Rick, and you search it, it's going to go and find that particular event. And so all the events are going to be searchable, sortable, and very easy for you to find. And that's just a really great way because, again, right now, as Sizzle is getting started, there's not thousands of events. But as we get hundreds and thousands of events, we're going to need to have more views to this. And so we needed to set it up so there will be searchable index so that you can get, get just your team's particular events. You can get this home meeting. And that's one of the features. But also is that you're going to see it's it's very dynamic. You can see a, a month at a time. This is a view of a week at a time. So when you click the week view, it's going to show you all the events for the particular week. If you click on any individual day in the calendar, it's going to show you just one day in the calendar, which is important because, for example, this is just Tuesday this week. You can see that uh, that we've got the 11 o'clock wake up with sizzle call. We get one o'clock. Josh is doing his talk. Talk at two o'clock. We're doing a um, an orientation for the distributors in Spanish and. At 8 o'clock, we've got a conference call arena, and 9 o'clock, we've got a Spanish conference call, and we've got testimonials going at 10. All these things are happening, and, of course, you can now click and find them very easy with the calendar with your monthly, daily, weekly view. And, and of course, what's great about it is when you just click on any of these events, it's going to pop up a nice little summary. So you can come out, and you can uh, just click on any event. It's going to tell you the call, the phone number, the access codes. So this is a great place. You can always go to get the webinar link. You can always go get the phone code. You can always go to get directions to an event. Everything is here because the events, when you create them, you can put locations, you can put attachments. And I haven't told you the coolest feature yet, but the coolest feature of that is this one, is that you can do the events yourself. And AK, you, know, you, you run the back end of things. You have a staff that takes care of this. Why is this huge that people can actually create their own events? You know, Jim, th that's a great question. And I want everybody to know, that this is basically going to be an upgrade and replace the current My Sizzle Pro event calendar. It's much like the upgrade that we did with Sizzle Disk. This is going to replace it. But I want to explain a little bit about what Jim's talking about because this is going to be so dynamic to every single person's business, especially tying in with what we're going to announce in a few weeks. Every single person that's in My Sizzle Pro can go in and actually put in, have full control now to put in their own events. So when we teach tools and corporate calendar on the wake up call on Thursdays, or you, you're having a, um, a home party and people want to find out when the next party is, you can actually go in, type in all the information, type in all the stuff about your event, and have p anybody be able to see that information and be able to come to maybe it's a home party, maybe it's a call, maybe it's a webinar. And every single person in the company is going to be able to see that event, they'll be able to see all the information, they'll be able to see exactly where it is. Isn't that right, Jim, because of one of the features that we have? Why don't you show them that? Absolutely. Yeah, and it's cool. And that's what's 
significant about this, AKS. For example, like Rick Wells just sent me an email yesterday, and he's got a, a ribbon cutting ceremony on a home meeting at his home on Thursday night. Now, in the past, what would happen is that he would send it to me. I might email it out to people in my team and community, but but between now and Thursday, it would be very difficult for me to get it on the national site because I would have to type up an email. I would have to send it in to the support staff. The support staff has to go and update the calendar. And, of course, not a big deal for updating the calendars when they're the recurring calls. But, you know, if you imagine when we got dozens and dozens and hundreds of meetings going on, it will be a big, big uh, task for someone to key all those things in. And so normally this wouldn't even get done. But what can happen now is that Rick doesn't even have to call me. I mean, he can actually go online and he can just say, I want to create a new event, and he'll put, the, he'll say, ribbon cutting at Rick and Terry's. He describes the event, and what's nice about it is he can, he, as he does it, he goes in, he picks the type, he says it's a home meeting, he picks the date, it's going to be Thursday night on the 17th from 6.30 to 8.30, nice pop-up calendars to do it, but then what he can do is he actually adds the location, so he can put his address in, 1776 Port Glass in Fleming Island, Florida, and the zip code, and by doing that, now, he just has a very simple screen to enter, and everyone on the Spicels Board can do this, and it's going to now add that to the calendar. So now on Thursday night, there's a new event, a new home meeting. Now, think about how many home meetings we've been missing and you've not known about, even though they're right in your area, because if you've got someone that's cross-lined to you or not part of your team holding an event, you need to know about it, and this is going to make it so much easier. And that's, uh, and that's just a super nice, easy thing to do. Everyone's got the ability to do it. But again, as you heard AK said, it's got some really nice features. Now, what you can do is, of course, you click on the event to bring it up. You can bring up directions. But you remember that Rick entered that location. Well, that location is Google Map enabled. So on the, on the link, there's going to be a link that says Google Maps. And you just click on that link. And it's going to, one single click, it's going to bring a map up. And you're going to see Fort Grass Lane and see right where Rick's house is off 17 in Fleming Island. So you know exactly how to get there. And, of course, if you do two clicks, you can see Rick's house. You know? So it's just, <laughs> it's just amazing, you know, uh, what the Internet gives us and the ability when we link tools like this in. So this is going to be a feature that is going to be really significant. And one of the reasons we're rolling this out now is that part of the whole big picture, and AK will talk more about this, is that we're going to be laying out some minor modules and some major modules throughout the year on MySocial Pro. And, of course, one of the major modules coming out is going to be the new weight loss challenge. And, of course, for that, we needed the ability for you to find events, check weight loss challenges in your area and be able to map them and things. And so this particular event module is, of course, going to be able to use for conference calls and webinars, but it's also going to be the fuel that's behind this particular event system so that you'll be able to go in and schedule your own weight loss challenge events and parties in your area and search for them. So, I'm going to turn it back over to you, AK, but I'm excited about having the event calendar online because I know that uh, I like to know everything that's happening in Sizzle, whether it's in my area or not, and this is going to give me a way to find it, search for it, share it, and make it very easy for me to do that. And also, I can run them myself without having to worry about having someone at corporate taking up their time to create these events and stuff. So back over to you, AK. Thank you, Jim. That was absolutely incredible. And guys, I want you to remember, we're going to have ongoing trainings in the all be inside of the academy on how to do all of this stuff. You're going to see a ton of different trainings that are going to be taking place. But I hope everybody's seeing how dynamite this one feature is with the calendar. And what you're seeing right now is actually a screenshot of the up and coming replicated site for weight loss that every single person is going to receive. There's so many incredible features with this. You're going to be absolutely blown away. And as you see, it looks totally stellar. It's really impressive. But like Jim was saying, we had to create a calendar so you can go in and you're having a weight loss, uh, a weight loss challenge party at your house. You want to be able to go in and put that in right away so anybody and everybody can see it. And as Jim showed you, you can basically see your house when you put in your address so they'll know exactly where it is. So there's no excuse not to get there. So this is truly, truly incredible. It's going to change the way um, in a big way of what we're doing with Sizzle. But, you know, guys, I, I want to thank you so much for your time. I know you guys have been, um, you know, I know this is Sunday. I know this is Mother's Day. I do want to give a big, big shout-out to the entire Denver team, Howard, Stephanie, Dr. Bill Bergman, Jackie and Dana Christensen, all that entire team that did such a remarkable job at that event, hundreds of people. It was so incredible. The stories that are coming in, you'll hear more about it tomorrow and throughout the week on the uh, Wake Up With Sizzle call. I know there'll be guests on there, and they'll be sharing some of the incredible stories that took place. 
It truly is remarkable. We're so excited with everything going on. And once again, if you want to listen to this again, it will be inside of your back office. So all of you can go into your back office, log into the academy. You'll be able to watch this or even share it with somebody else. But I want you to stay tuned because next week and the week after, we're going to slowly start showing you a little bit more about the weight loss challenge that we're going to be releasing. And guys, this is incredible. This is a game changer. It's going to not only allow us to compete with all the other weight loss companies, it's going to allow us to dominate because what we have with Sizzle is truly the best of the best in every aspect of everything that we do. So thank you so much for joining in. We really appreciate your time, and happy Mother's Day to everybody once again. Thank you so much.